So, like he says, don't wear any wet underwear all the time. And that, he did say once I heard that he, he, he likes briefs. So I'm confused. We're going to send him some briefs because I'm really, I'm just worried he doesn't have any underwear. And that's, uh, let's put the skid marks in there for him. It's Box Truck Curry. We made it. All right, Box Truck Corey got the real sad news. I I woke up uh, this morning, 2 a.m. Uh, what is today? The 11th of January, 2020. I saw Blind Views do a video saying that he's confirmed that Box Truck Corey has passed away uh, on Wednesday. I guess that's the uh, 10th, 9th, 8th. Uh, box Truck Corey is a Canadian dude. He's uh, li he was living in a box truck. And this was uh, from 2018, October. He was going to play a little joke on me and send me. He has a T. I have a box truck, truck Corey T shirt somewhere. I can't, I haven't been able to find it for this little uh, show here tonight. But um, he did this video back in October of 2018 where he was sending me some stuff, some stickers, and. Uh, and uh, wanted to send me some underwear because I, I sometimes say, you know, in my closing comments, you know, and don't wear any underwear, which is a joke. But I get this pair of red, <laughs> tidy, tidy reddies, and uh, it really looks like there's skid marks in them, you know, and I'm like, that's weird. And I just tossed them. I went, you know, I was at the, at the post office box and I said, I get some pretty weird stuff in the mail. And I just tossed them and said, that's it. And uh, then he does this video explaining that it was all a joke and he just took some uh, candy and whatever and just kind of, you know, made, made the marks that weren't real skid marks. And I, you know, they're perfectly good underwear. I could have just thrown them in the wash once and out of that. But what a guy, you know, he had some issues. He had some health issues, quite a few of them. He's mentioned them on his show. I'm not going to get into all those other things, uh, but... Uh, he, he, he had some seri more serious stuff come up in the past week and passed away on Wednesday. So if you look at his channel, his description is terminally ill man sells everything and starts van life in his tiny house box truck. Traveling around the U.S., Canada and Mexico, box truck Corey learns what life is really about, imparts his so-called wisdom and explores the plight of the homeless and vehicle dwellers along their way. So, he has had a number of issues, health issues on the road, and especially too when he returns back to his native Canada. I think he did a couple videos back uh, over the summer where he was talking about some breathing issues he had and some heart issues and some other issues. But it was amazing how he persevered. He was he was doing videos all over. One place he really enjoyed being was um, Slab City. He he spent a lot of time, and he spent and he did quite a few videos shirtless there. <laughs> you know he and and, and he had his uh, trademark kind of goatee beard, which he did shave off at one point. Uh, and he has had a lot of issues. You know. Uh, uh, dealing with injuries on the road. I think he was at, he was at the van, the last batch of videos we got from him was uh, being on the, uh, the van build there, the, uh, How, the Howa van build, which was one back in October that uh, Cheap RV Living Bob was holding. Uh, anyway, a lot of videos from Slab City. And as we can see here, yeah. And there's the one, yeah. Camo Dave Joke Gift Parody. <laughs> parody. That was funny. Uh, really nice sense of humor. And uh, really cool guy. Box Truck Corey. Rest in peace. I'm going to miss this guy. He's really, really a, funny, a really a funny guy. Great channel. Check it out if you haven't. And uh, all our best to his friends and family and all our condolences. And we want to say, uh, rest in peace, Corey. We'll miss you. All right, that's it. Vlog under.